Hey everybody, Ann here, sitting inside the tiny house having my coffee today because it's been raining. It rained half the night and it's been raining this morning. It's going to stop here in a little bit. So, I'm kind of wanting to do something indoors and I have this burning urge to put up that little bit of reflectance that I got on my roof. Um, well, it's not on the roof yet, but I want to get it up there. It's just 10 feet. Um, and I've got a little stepladder that I can reach the low parts with it. So I'm going to give that a shot today. Piece of cake. Um, I, I thought of doing it this way, you know, and just bringing it up across like that. But this, the width was just a little bit too short. These cabins are not built like 16 inches on center, 24 inches on center. I mean, and every stud placement is different. Um, they're very sturdy, but they're kind of weird. So I just did it this way. This is just 10 feet. Now I kind of messed up a little bit because initially I was having trouble getting it all the way over there. Um, so I started here. There's just a remnant piece that I cut off of, um, sorry if I'm panning too quickly, off of the end of that. And um, I decided I'm just going to see if I can get it up over here because uh, I didn't know where I was going to staple it to. Um, right now, it's a little bit too short. It needed to go from that stud all the way over to that one. And I needed to staple it to that one. But um, it's just up there right now. I've stapled it. It's stapled to the roof. I'm going to have to pull that out. Um, and when I get more of this, I'll get a big enough piece that will go all the way over here. I might just leave that one up. Take it, take the staples out of that and staple the other one correctly underneath to the underneath part of there. Um, this was not a problem at all. I just used my two little step ladder thingy. Um, and working with the 10 foot rolls was pretty easy. Um, they come in like 50 foot rolls, different sizes. If I get a roll that big, I don't know, I may cut it down. But this was not a problem. Um, my little step ladder could get me all the way up to here. Um, so I'm going to need a big tall ladder. And then I will just overlap and then put it, you know, just overlap just a little bit each strand that I put up. And uh, just do it until it's done. That was not hard at all. If I get a big step ladder, I'm going to be able to get all of it. It's like 1 p.m. and I haven't even gotten out of my jammies or brushed my hair yet. I've had my coffee, yes. Um, I may stay in my jammies all day long. Yeah, I'm just happy. I'm, I'm going to be able to do this. I am going to be able to insulate this roof. And it's increasing my confidence with getting up some kind of boards, you know, something up there to cover up the insulation. Um, it's not going to happen overnight. It's going to be little by little when I can afford to buy a 10 foot stretch. I don't know how much they are. It's not very much though. Um, just one at a time. I'm going to get them and put them up. And, um, the real challenge is going to be here. Let me show you. See that right there? Um, I won't be insulating the inside of that. That goes over the porch. Um, but I'm going to have to figure out how to do the boards and everything on that. Um, it's, some of it's going to go this way and some of it's going to go that way. So I'll figure it out though. Excuse the mess over there up on top of that cabinet thing. I've just got so much stuff. Um, I'm going to be going through things and, um, donating whatever I have that I don't use regularly. Um, I don't know. There's a thrift store in the area. I might take some stuff over there, but I'm happy. I'm happy I was able to do that. Go me. I think I need to go brush my hair now. Yeah. Well, it's after 3 p.m. And I'm still in my jammies, and I haven't brushed my hair. Yep, just sitting around eating Funyuns. Funny story, I came in from being outside uh, feeding the chickens. I went and did some grazing for the ones that don't free range and threw it in their pens. Came back in, and this here, right here, this is what I put my doggy treats in. In addition to the big bones, it was filled all the way to the top with little dog bones. The lovely person who sent the package yesterday... Uh, included a whole box of little bones and you see how much is left yeah so those puppies especially Sonny I think Sonny was the ringleader um, he woke up with a normal size belly and now his belly is so big he ate I think he ate most of them they're on the floor playing right now but check it out they ate half a thing 
And they also got up into Papa's dog food bowl, ate all of the food that was in the bowl, in addition to having their breakfast this morning of puppy food. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be cleaning up a mess, I'm sure. Um, you know, they go outside, but I tell you what, I got puppy pads. Oh my gosh, I need puppy pads so bad. I definitely need more puppy pads. Um, and they do utilize the puppy pads, but I want to start, you know, pulling back from the puppy pads, but not today because puppies ate way too much food. <laughs> Papa's being good. He's being tolerant. They've got so much to chew on, yet they like to chew on stuff they're not supposed to. They grab my tennis shoes. They grab my little flip-flop thingies. Oh, Papa's being a good boy. What's up, Sonny? Look at that big, fat belly. It's time for their second shots and second worms. Worming. I gotta tell you, ain't nothing else going on. I just made some lunch. Um, survival food from Augustin Farms. I ordered it off the internet. <laughs> Amazon. I didn't care for it. Uh, maybe I should do a video someday on the different foods that I've tried. Shell stable foods. So called survival foods. And whether or not they're worth the price. Um, some of it, mm, not so much. But I ate it because I don't believe in wasting food, and I gave Papa some too. Definitely not the puppies. Anyhow, so uh, yeah, I'm just gonna sit here, finish my funyuns, uh, look at my roof with the one little strip of Reflectix on it, and just feel happy that I I did that, and I'm gonna be able to do the rest. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Um. You know what? I'm just going to cut this one short because there's nothing else to talk about. I hope you are all well. I hope your weather isn't too bad. And I hope your health is good and that you're happy and you're in good spirits. Um, otherwise, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.